Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I hope that you guys are all doing really well. So today's video is going to be an Ipsy and Boxy Charm unboxing. As I mentioned back in January, I decided to go ahead and start including unboxings of my Ipsy and my Boxy Charm just because they are subscriptions that I have coming each month and that I do enjoy. And so I figured each month I would share with you guys what I actually got in my Ipsy bag and my BoxyCharm box. So last month I actually did these as two separate videos, but this month I decided to combine them and do it as like a versus, like Ipsy versus BoxyCharm type video. And I may continue to do it this way moving forward each month, just to be able to show you what I got in each one and kind of compare which one I preferred over the other for that particular month. So of course this month is going to be the box in the bag that I got for the month of February and if you're not familiar with the way that this works basically these are both beauty subscriptions that you can sign up for and then each month you get this delivered to your door so the boxy charm one is $21 a month and this one actually gives you four to five full-size beauty products and it kind of ranges anywhere between makeup skincare hair care you know different types of things and then the ipsy bag is actually $10 a month and with that one, you get four to five deluxe sample size products. And also with the Ipsy bag, you do take like a quiz or questionnaire that kind of helps them to create a bag specific for you. Whereas with the BoxyCharm, everybody gets the exact same thing, I think. So that's kind of a little bit of information about the two of them. I will have links in the description bar, kind of towards the top of the description bar for BoxyCharm and for the Ipsy bag if you want to sign up for them or if you just want to check out the websites and get a little bit more information. So if you would like to see what I got in my Ipsy and my BoxyCharm this month, then please keep watching. So starting off with my Ipsy bag, this is what it comes in, a super cute metallic hot pink envelope, which I absolutely love. And when I take everything out of the bag, the very first thing that I have in here is this Marula Pure Beauty Oil. It's a foaming cleansing oil, and it says on here that it hydrates, restores, and rebalances for all skin types. This is actually a product that I got with my Ipsy points. So each month, if you review the products that you got in your bag or there's different things that you can do on the website to earn points, you can actually redeem those points for beauty products. So I had a couple of points that I didn't want to expire, so I went ahead and decided to redeem them for this to try it out, and I'm looking forward to it. I always love a good foaming cleanser so and I've never heard of this brand and this is a pretty good amount of product so I'm definitely excited to try this out and then this is what the bag actually looks like which I'm really really obsessed with this bag I think that I'm going to take all of the makeup out of my makeup bag that I keep in my purse and put this bag in there because it will match my purse perfectly but I think that this is super cute for February it's got like an envelope with a heart kind of like a love note and then on the back of it it's just like a um I don't know what you would call this material like that shiny type material and then of course it's hot pink on the back so I'm obsessed with the bag first impression I absolutely love the actual design of the bag so let's go into it and see what's actually inside of it so the very first thing that I see inside of the bag is this nail polish it's a perfect formula pink gel top coat and I think that this is basically like one of those nail polishes that you would use if you get like a French manicure this would be like a top coat that you would place on top of that I'm sure you could use it for other things outside of that I don't actually have a polish like this so I'm sure I will get tons of use out of it the next thing that I see in here is a lotion this is it says candy vanilla hand and body lotion so this is actually right on time because I had like a mini size bath and body works lotion that I carry in my purse and I recently used all of that up so I can go ahead and stick this in there but it says on here that it's an almond extract or it has or is enriched with almond extract and argan oil and this is what it looks like just a regular lotion but it smells really good. It smells kind of like a mixture between vanilla and like shea butter, which I really like. 
and it's really moisturizing. So definitely looking forward to getting some use out of that. So the next product that I have in here is a sample size product of the Dr. Brandt Pore Dermabrasion Pore Perfecting Exfoliator. So if you've been following my channel for a while, you know that I have really oily skin and large pores, which normally goes hand in hand with oily skin. So this is definitely something that I'm looking forward to trying out. And it says on here that it refines the appearance of pores deep cleanses pores and smooths skin texture so i know that dr brand is like a really great um brand they're more of like a high-end brand but i've heard a lot of great things about the brand so definitely looking forward to trying this out as well and then the next thing that i have in here is a product from bella pierre cosmetics and this is a mineral blush it's actually in the shade desert rose which looks really, really beautiful. It'll probably be really great as like an everyday blush, especially with the spring being right around the corner. And I actually haven't ever tried a mineral blush before, so I'm actually really excited to try this out. And the last thing is a sample size of the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Oil. And I have heard a little bit about this product, not a ton. But it says on here that it creates an ideal canvas for makeup, reduces the appearance of dry fine lines, increases moisture in four weeks, and you're supposed to let it absorb into skin before applying your makeup. So this is an oil that can be used day or night and also underneath your makeup. Now, as I just mentioned, I have really oily skin, so it probably will not be something that I use underneath my makeup. It doesn't really smell like anything, but... um. Definitely something that I will try out using in the evening before I go to bed. And this is something else that I've heard a lot of good things about. So I'm excited to have gotten this in my bag to try out before I actually spend the money to purchase the full size product. So next up, let's go ahead and move on to BoxyCharm. So when I open the box, the very first thing that I see in here is another card. And this one says, Rush to Relax. From stilettos to slippers, get ready to work hard and rest easy. And another thing that I really love about BoxyCharm is that on the back of their cards, they actually list all the products that are included in the box as well as the price point for each one of them. So I really love that about BoxyCharm. And it also includes a little description of how you're supposed to use it, what it's supposed to be for, all that good stuff. So the very first thing that I see in here is a Shrey Miss Amazing sensitive dry skin moisturizing mask and I'm really excited about this because I am a huge huge mask person um so I'm definitely excited to try this but it basically opens up like a little envelope and then on the inside you have the mask so I'm sure that this is a sample size product and then it has a little card in here also that just explains how to use the mask, but it says on here that, oh, this is actually a full size product and it retails for $12. So that's pretty cool. I'm excited about using that. Like I said, I love using masks, so I may actually use this tonight. So the next thing in here that I'm actually really excited about is this product from Ofra. And this is one of their refill um, little pans. And it is a yellow powder, like kind of like a banana powder for setting underneath your eyes. So I've never actually tried any of Ofra's face products, but I'm always down to try out a banana powder because that is what I love to set underneath my eyes with. So I'm actually really excited to have gotten this and to try it out. So that is the next thing, and this is also a full-size product that retails for $12. So already with the first two products, we're at $22, and the box has already paid for itself. So really excited to try this out as well. So the next thing that I see in here is this little pink box, and it says Real Tree Perfume. So let me go ahead and open this baby up, and this is what it looks like. And, oh, it smells really good. Oh, yes, it smells really good. So I think that this will be perfect to throw in my purse and kind of take on the go. And let's see, on this little card, it says, this is a travel size 
version that retails for $12.99. So, and it says on here too that it's a sweet scent of pomegranate with a hint of persimmon and an exotic scent of orchids. It smells really, really good. So, another great product from this box as well. And then the next thing in here is an anti-aging eye serum. This is by the brand Freeze 24-7. And lately I've actually been into trying out like under eye moisturizers and eye serums and stuff like that because I do tend to get some dryness around my eye area. So I definitely will be putting this to good use. And this product says that this is a sample size version, but the full size version retails for $58, which is really expensive. So I have very high expectations for this product. But definitely looking forward to trying this one out. So next up, the next product in here is a product by the shade Beauty For Real. And it is a blush and go cream blush and luminizer. So this is what the product looks like. This is what the box looks like. And you basically just take the top off and it's like a twist up, I think. Oh, it's double ended. So, okay, so this side is a blush. And this side is a highlighter. So that's pretty cool. I didn't realize that it was double-ended. So let's see. Okay, so here are some swatches of what it actually looks like. This side obviously is the blush. And this side is the highlighter. So I'm actually pretty impressed with this. It's a really nice, you know, pigmented, creamy product that I think will be really great, especially with spring and summer being a right around the corner. These will be great just to give a really nice, fresh face look. So, haven't ever heard of this brand, haven't ever tried a cream, blush, or highlighter, so excited to try this out as well. So the very last thing that's in this box is something that I'm actually really excited about. I think this is super cute. It's by the brand Spongel. I think is how you pronounce it, but it's a body wash infused buffer and polish all in one kind of loofah sponge type situation. So on the card, it obviously says that this one is a full size product as well and it retails for $15. And it says it's a heart shaped body wash infused buffer enriched with hydrating olive oil and a blend of energizing and toning extracts. So I think this is actually a really great idea. I haven't ever heard of anything like this, a sponge that's already infused with body wash. And it says on here that you basically just wet it in the shower and it will lather up and then you just use it to, you know, wash up and exfoliate and all that good stuff. And it is double sided. So one side is a sponge that you actually use to cleanse and then the other side is a little bit rougher in texture and you can use that to exfoliate. So I'll let you guys know how I like this, but I'm definitely excited to use it because I've never tried or heard of anything like this before. So that is everything that I got in my BoxyCharm for the month of February. And when I total everything up with the exception of the eye serum, since that one, the full size retails for $58, but I only got a sample size, which I'm not sure what that retails for. But everything else in the box actually totals to $75.99. So like I mentioned in the beginning of the video, the box itself is only $21 a month. So it definitely paid for itself more than double. So I definitely think that it's a great subscription service to have. I also think that the Ipsy bag is a great subscription service to have. And normally I there's one that I prefer over the other each month. But honestly, for the month of February, I feel like both of these really hit it out of the park. I don't think that there was any product in any of the two boxes that I was disappointed by or that I feel like I won't use. I feel like everything that I got this month, I'm really excited to try and I just really think they did a great job for the month of February. So that is all that I have for you guys for this video of my Boxy and Ipsy bag unboxings for the month of February. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you are subscribed to either of these two services, definitely let me know in the comments down below what you got and what you're most excited to try out. Also, if you're not subscribed to these services, but you're interested in trying them out, again, I will have the links in the description bar down below. So definitely make sure to go ahead and expand that portion and click on those links. And it'll take you right to the website so that you can get more information and sign up if you're interested. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.